Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya Dikshit. I'm a dermatologist practicing in Bangalore from the last 15 years. Hives are very commonly seen and called as allergy by lay people. So, what is the cause of this hives? How does it look? We are here to discuss that today. So, hives look like swelling, flat swelling on the skin, on the arms, on the face. It can come in any part of the body, including the hands and feet. So, it usually look like tiny red skin elevations, but it can become large, flat, map-like areas of elevation as well. We know them as urticaria. In our medical term, we call it as urticaria. And it is so common that it is believed that more than 90% of the population will have hives once in their lifetime. It can be seen as a reaction. Mostly people describe it look like mosquito bites or ant bites which become more swollen. But when hives become bigger and bigger, it can become a very severe problem, not only because it disturbs your sleep or your activities because you're busy scratching, but if it starts to involve your eyes, your lips, it could compromise even the breathing. So it is a serious condition. However, it can be seen very, very commonly as a very mild condition. So what are the common causes of hives? One of the most common causes of hives, like I said, is an insect bite allergy. You could be having it because of an insect bite or it could also be due to some food or some drug which does not agree with you. Usually people are able to tell us that, you know, whenever I eat this particular food, maybe an egg or maybe milk, I do get these kind of allergies. It may just look like a mild itching and slight redness whenever you scratch, but it comes every time you eat that particular medicine or particular food. The other thing is that sometimes with chronic infections as well, especially hepatitis virus infections, you do get to see hives. So when you first see a doctor for hives, the doctor is going to ask you, how long have you had the symptom? Is it something which is very new, only few days old? Then the concerns might be more like insect bites or food allergy or even a medicine allergy. But when it starts to last longer and longer, it could be the marker of an underlying skin condition like a thyroid problem or a hormone problem or a viral infection or a urinary infection and the tests have to be more elaborate. The common treatment of hives is uh, giving an anti-allergy tablets called antihistamines. There are many types of antihistamines. It doesn't mean that if you did not respond to one antihistamine, none of them will work for you. Antihistamines are very, very mild um, medicines. They don't have side effects. So you can take them for long period of times safely. Sometimes when it is not able to diagnose what is the cause of the hives, the medicines may be continued for months together, even years together. Please don't worry. But it is important to rule out the underlying conditions. So if you are having hives which are not responding to treatment, please speak to your dermatologist and get a more clarity on what is happening for you.